Hello everyone, this is Bidesika Salam from Pace Media and in this short video let me talk about designing logo for your transparent header. Yeah, uh, these are the, the things that uh, I have to talk about is uh, applied for, it can be applied for all types of headers but uh, it is uh, this thing is much more important for transparent header. Here as you can see this page media logo uh, it is too ugly right there is a white background in this page media logo image this is not what we want this is too ugly yeah so when you design a um, uh, transparent header your uh, logo should also have transparent background if you have background color then it's too ugly so you have to be aware of in the customize you can change the logo here uh, this is for uh, uh, theme header if you design your header with the um, uh, elementor page builder then you have to go to the elementor header theme builder to change the logo but if you design the header with uh, theme builder uh, theme header then you have to go to customize like this is header uh, side identity here here you can see uh, you can change the logo here default uh, template logo is this one this mountain select skip cropping yeah yes not this one but the white one maybe this one skip cropping like this now yeah instead of uh, black or other colors and the, we are using yeah the white color this is to contrast with the background color in a transparent header so we have all the change all the menus to white colors to uh, to contrast with the background color yeah and these things you have to be aware of now here let's go to the photoshop yeah most of the art designing uh, is done in photoshop or editing uh, for logo design you can do the corel draw or yeah illustrator but yeah we are, we are i'm more familiar with photoshop so i'm doing with photoshop here where we can remove this background color you can delete it now we have transparent background now and the size for the image size or converse size uh, here pixels in pixels you give the pixel white of the image yeah it's comparative white of the image uh, in between 400 yeah 400 to 600 not uh, greater than 600 if we, it is larger than 600 then it will be file size so it will be much larger we do not need large file size here is, as you can see here it is about only about two, 200 or some uh, something pixels here so we do not uh, need last logo false uh, logo so yeah uh, you do not need last for, for logo for image file and if you, it is uh, smaller than 300 yeah and this white image white if it is smaller than 300 then uh, yeah clarity will be much worse so keep between uh, 350 or 400 to 600 and height if it is not your if your if your website logo is not circular yeah uh, now it is not common yeah but we used to have circular logos if your website is not circular logo then yeah then keep your height about 160 or below like this okay and yeah, now we have transparent header we can save the image you have to click ctrl s or here in the save s and you have to choose file png format to uh, to get the transparent uh, transparent background you have to save in png format here logo demo dot png now let's save it 
smallest file size okay now let's go back to the here we can change the logo upload it here this is the one now select it skip cropping Uh, like this but yeah as you can see here uh we cannot see the logo properly in the transparent header yeah you get the point but you have we have already removed the uh, background color you can see a transparent uh, hair and logo you can increase the white here like this but we do not need to last file size about uh, maximum 300 yeah maximum 300 is okay like this uh, like this you can design your yeah, transparent header uh, if here you have to be aware of something if it is only text logo only text logo or something like this simple then you can use yeah uh, color or something like white color to contrast to the background in the when you use transparent header but sometimes if you're designing uh, this website for your clients then they have already their own logo they have already own logo for their business they have their own color schemes yeah in a logo there will be at least three colors in their color schemes then it is hard to change it to uh, mono mono color black white or black something it will be con uh, it will be contradictory to the logo uh, is color scheme brand of their of their company so in that case yeah you have to use like this uh, with the transfer header uh, as far as possible try to yeah um, and you can adjust on the background color background this here there is something uh, uh, color overlay in this background color we may try to uh, reduce a bit yeah to reduce the contradictory between this logo and all and you can also change the these colors to somehow or adding some background or something yeah to yeah uh, to adapt to the logo color uh, it is brand new business brand new website or brand new then you can uh, talk to your client and adjust the logo color scheme yeah, but if it is already set up brand then yeah it's hard to change the logo then you have to adjust in your in your in adjust the other things like background overlay color text typography color to match the logo the brand of their company yeah, the best thing that you have to be aware of one thing yeah there should be transparent background in your logo to get the transfer in you have to save your image in png format png format you have to be aware of to get the transparent background and the size for for the image logo file maximum is 600 minimum is 300 and the maximum logo file size here displaying in the website is maximum 300 here that is 300 if it, it is larger than 300 then it won't be look good uh, too much uh, yeah so yeah like this the two uh, things you have to be aware of yeah 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 and, um, most of the uh, pro web designers are uh, are aware of these things but uh, mainly it is for the beginners those who design start to design website which what praise they may not be aware of just such things so this is for beginners and if you find this video helpful and you like this video please click the thumbs up button and if you have not subscribed my youtube channel then subscribe now